Hey guys, this is Mr. 8 Krizzy here, and in today's movie review, I'm going to be reviewing the 2019 comedy horror film from Fox Searchlight Pictures, and this, and this, and this movie was also released in 2019, around, around, around the time that Fox Searchlight Pictures was celebrating its 25th anniversary, and that's going to be on the 2019 film Ready or Not. So, Ready, Ready or Not is, is, is from the same directors who worked on Devil's Do and later Scream 5. And so <clears throat> the, the story the, the story of Ready or Not is about this. Grace couldn't couldn't be happier after she marries the, the man of her dreams at, at his family's l l luxurious estate. There, there's just one catch. She must she must now hide from from midnight until dawn from from her new in laws that hunt hunt her down with, with with guns, crossbows, and other weapons. As Grace desperately tries to survive the night, she soon finds a way to turn the tables on, on her not not so lovably. Not so lovable relatives, and and of course that's the story of Ready or Not. So what do I think of it? I remember when this movie when this movie came out like during August of 2019, around around the time I was turning 20 years old that year, and that and that same month, I, I I've been hearing really good things about Ready or Not. I've been hearing I've been hearing lots of great things about about this film, and so all the way up until now that that I that I actually rented this movie on video on demand like VOD. So I watched the whole thing last night before I went to bed. And and, and in my opinion, I got to say, Ready or Not is is actually is actually a a, re a really great and awesome and awesome comedy horror film from 2019. Yeah, cuz I honestly think this movie was awesome. Yeah, and cuz one one of one of the things that makes this movie awesome is that is that is that it's, it's like a combination of comedy and horror film cuz you know cuz like, because I think the first half just the, the first half like like there's not really that much of the, there's not really that much comedy in this film there is a little bit but not but not too much but but I, I, but you know as we get into like the third act like you know during like the last act like you know the final the final like the you know the final thing like you know that happens during the the, the third act it, it, it's it's what gets very serious and also scary too because because that's the point of this movie a, a scary movie while at the same time that there are some comedy scenes a little bit but they're not too much like i said because because i gotta i gotta say ready or not is actually more of a horror film it's more of a scary movie when you think about it and i, and I think brian tyler's music score brian tyler's music music score is good like it, it's really cool and the and the performances the performances i i thought were were, were, were good too like um Adam Adam Brody Adam Brody was in this film he was good Adam Brody and Andy McDowell from Groundhog Day and Muppets from Space like Andy McDowell she was good and yeah and, and like I said like re Ready or Not Ready or Not was that was uh, Ready or Not is 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 one one of the three films made made by the same directors who worked on devil's do which I, I never really saw devil's do i only saw previews of devil's do and i and I, it didn't look that interesting to me and and of course the the directors of, of the, the directors of ready or not would later direct the, the direct the 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 fifth screen film like screen five and because the, the names of the directors who worked on ready or not devil's do and screen five those would be like matt matt Matt, but, but, excuse me, guys. I, 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 I always most of the time I have trouble pronouncing names right. But, but, but I, but I do know how to pronounce the other director's name, like, like Tyler Gillett. Like Tyler Gillett, he was he he was one of the he was one of the directors who worked on this film along with the others that I just said. And yeah, and, and of course, like Ready or Not also had a good soundtrack too. But but besides t besides Brian Tyler's music score, it also had some good. So it also had a good soundtrack of songs that were featured in this film. Like 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 some of them were like were like classical music, like classical music that I know by Beethoven, and you know some like other classical music from like a long time ago. And yeah, and, and and I think Fox Searchlight Pictures it, 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 it does a, a good job to, a good job working on this film. Like and, and and of course you know and one one of the one of their films released in 2019 during their 25th anniversary of the company itself, Fox Searchlight Pictures. So yeah, so that's so that's pretty much all there is to say for from for my thoughts on Ready or Not. So so overall. Ready or Not was an, an awesome horror film from 2019, and I'm going to give Ready or Not 4 out of 5 stars. If, if you like horror movies and if you haven't seen Ready or Not yet, like, if, 
Like, if you haven't seen Ready or Not, then I recommend it. Yeah, because because from 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 what I heard from one of my friends, like like they they because they, 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 they one one of my friends might check it out someday. Since I know in in some countries like Canada, this movie is currently streaming on Disney Plus, but but only in Canada because we're I'm, I'm in the United States. I live in Maryland, like Baltimore, Maryland, Ellicott City, Maryland. So, so yeah, I, I and like I said, I watched Ready or Not on, on on demand last night before I went to bed. So there you go. So yeah, I, so yeah, I definitely recommend Ready or Not. And so that's going to be it for this movie review on Ready or Not. And that's going to be it for this video. So make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet. And as always, thanks for watching. And until next time, this is Mr. A. Crizzy saying goodbye, everybody. And that's about it.